Hey y'all, welcome to my channel. Today I'm doing my Louis Vuitton bag collection. If you are new, my name is Candace and I do luxury fashion and designer beauty videos, also beauty, fashion, and lifestyle. If you're not new, welcome back. Thanks for staying subscribed and tuning in once again to my Lux videos. Also, because this is the Lux and Lipstick channel, today my lip of the day is the ColourPop Ultra Matte Lip in Season 10. And it's just red lippy. So let's jump right in to my collection. Oh yeah! So this video is not going to be inclusive of SLGs, it's just strictly going to be bags. Also ironically, I am holding a piece from Louis Vuitton. Oh no, what should I put this down on? I have to wipe this off with a clean cloth. I have an agenda that I have a list of all of my bags, so I'm very organized today. You guys should be proud of me. <laughs> just saying, okay? Don't want to toot my own horn, but... Let's dive in. So I have all my Louis in this area, so it'll be really easy to reach and grab everything. So I'm gonna start with the first thing I have from Louis Vuitton. That is the Louis Vuitton multi pochette accessoire. And I got the one with the green strap. This is one of the original ones. It used to be very hard to get. I think it kinda is still hard to get. Basically it has the shorter strap here. It detaches. So it has the shorter strap connection or a little small little pochette that can be detached. That's why it's called the multi pochette. There are two different pochettes. And of course you've seen what this looks like several times I'm sure. On the strap there's also a coin purse. I always look to see if I have any coins in here. Y'all know I love coins. Okay just seeing. And there aren't any. If you want a specific review on this I can definitely do one. This video is specifically telling what all I have in my collection. Right now it just went up in price. This retails for $2050. $2050 which is crazy. I think I paid $1700, 1600 for it when I got it. Crazy how much they are now. Whoa! <laughs> What? I spend around too much. I'm gonna just do my monogram pieces first. This is the Petit Sac Plaque. Plat. Petit Sac Plat from Louis Vuitton. I have a review for this already up. I'll link it up above. It was actually one of my very first videos I posted on this channel. It's a cutie. This retails for $13.60 now. <sighs> I don't want to say it, but I'm actually considering selling this. I'm considering. I don't know if I am yet. Because I feel like I have so much monogram. I know a lot of people have more monogram than I do, but I just feel like I have too much. I don't know. I haven't decided, so don't email me. I mean, you can, I guess. But I don't know. I probably won't sell it because it was so hard for me to get. That's not a real excuse to keep it right. I don't know. For now, it's staying in my collection, though. Also, monogram. This is the Louis Vuitton Vogarod. Vogarod. I have no idea how to pronounce it. It is top handle. I absolutely love this. I fell in love with it. I was buying a totally different bag. I think I was picking up my... What was I picking up? I think I was picking up actually this. My Pochette Matisse. Which I'm gonna get to. And I saw this in the store. I was like, what is that? And they told me what it was. And then I got it. That's kind of how this happened. I do love it because it is larger than my other Louis Vuitton bags. And I love it because it has this black contrast at the bottom here. Again, if you want a review on this, I can definitely do one. It does come with the longer strap. It's just adorable. I love this. I really like it. Also, this retails for $24.20. $2,420. Also in monogram, I have my Nano Speedy. I believe I have a video up for this as well. I'll link that up above. Also, any videos I mentioned that aren't up there will be down there. So, no worries on that. This is very infamous. I won't spend a lot of time talking about it again. It's such a cutie. Also, Unicorn. Very hard to get. This retails for $11.80. That's still kind of reasonable, but thinking of where Louis Vuitton prices used to be, it's kind of outrageous. But now, this this and the Petit Sac Plaque also have Vachetta or the light. You can already tell the difference. This one is darkened, my Petit Sac Plaque, and then this one's still light. It's so weird how that happened. I don't mind the darker at all. I actually like it darker. It's more complimentary to my skin complexion, but I don't mind the lighter either. It doesn't really matter to me. Last monogram piece I have, this is actually an Emprunt Leather. I think that's how they pronounce it. This is my Pochette Matisse, and I believe this color is tomato red. They don't make this color anymore. They have a red now that's darker. Just to let you know, the one that's on the site is not this. This one is lighter. They had two reds at one point. This is the lighter one. I got this a few years ago. This retails for $24.20 as well. Come in a standard $24.20. What is up with that? But I can also do a review on this one. If you so wish, just request it. I'll be happy to do it whenever I get the opportunity. I really like this. I wear this all year long. I know some people wear red just in the wintertime around the holidays. Not me. If it's summertime, springtime, and I want to wear a red bag, I'm gonna wear it. We all spend too much money to be concerned about seasons. That's just my opinion on that. Forget about this one. This is also Malagrand. This is just 
their special edition game on monogram and it's the white monogram this is called i should know this this is the vanity pm of course and the white monogram this retails for $27.60. It's just like their standard Vanity PM that's in regular monogram leather. It's just in their limited edition colors. Another cutie that I really love. Love this design. I love the colors. This is something I will never ever get rid of either. And it's also top handle. Has a longer strap. Moving on to Damier EB. This is my Alma BB. I haven't had a chance to do a review on this, but I am planning one soon. This was also kind of tricky to get. I don't know why. Like they just need to have enough stock so people that want them can get them. But I can't understand why they do. I know I personally don't like having the same bag everyone else does. That is why I do not have a never full. I feel like everybody has one. No matter who you are, everybody has that bag. That's why I don't want it. Dior book tote, same kind of thing. Too many people have it. I don't want it. I just really like this. This is also top handle, longer strap, all of that. This retails for $14.80. This is one of the Louis Vuitton bags I feel is still pretty reasonable. Because if you think about the Nano Speedy, that one is $11.80. For just $300, you get a whole lot more room and a much bigger bag. Just something to think about. If you're looking for affordable bags, affordable bags from Louis Vuitton that are still worth it, you know? I have my corset. This was actually my very first Louis Vuitton bag, I believe. Yeah, my very first Louis Vuitton bag. And I got this multiple years ago, maybe three or four years ago. This retails now for $17.90. This is in the Damier Azur, obviously. And this has really patina. Why not too bad? You can see. Still, it's pretty. It's light. It's not too dark, but it has darkened. I don't mind that once again. Also, I can do a review on this. It's still available on the site, so it's not like it was a limited product. I know it was really popular amongst bloggers a few years ago. I still have it. I still love it. It's my only Damier Azure piece. I do want to add to that. I don't know exactly what I want. I might wait for something new to release and then grab that. My last Damier piece is my absolute favorite Louis Vuitton bag. That was limited edition. Oh my gosh. I love this so much. And believe it or not, it goes with so many outfits. I know that's crazy, but it really does. I was actually shocking myself to see how many things it went with. This is called the Damier Valisette or Valisette BB. That's it. That's what this is called. This was released in 2019. I don't remember what collection it is, unfortunately, but if you just type that in, it will come up. I have seen these secondhand. I got this in pre-order. I don't even think it was available in stores. It sold out during pre-order. I'm so lucky to get my hands on this. I love this so much. It is my absolute favorite Louis Vuitton bag ever. And I wear it more than I expected. I could do a dedicated review on this. I have a bag insert in here. It has the standard Damier bean print in the inside. It's so cute. Like I said, I have a bag insert in there just to keep things organized, but I could do a dedicated review on this as well as others. And as I was mentioning, I believe they do have a Damier a Bean version of the same bag available now if you want to check it out. This is my favorite bag. It works with so many things. I love the unique print of this. I wish they would make more things in this. I know they did with that collection. During that time, I had a really, really low budget, you know, when it comes to things. And I really had to be strategic in what I purchased because during that time, I wasn't make them, making that much money. So I really had to save longer to get things. And I couldn't just go buy two or three things at once. I had to really save to get those. I'm really glad I got my hands on that. It is my favorite bag over everything. Over the Nano Speedy. Over all my BB. Over all of these bags. It's my favorite. That is my Louis Vuitton bag collection. I have a few SLGs too. I can do that as well. Also, I have a, what do you call it? A mini pochette too in monogram. Do not interrupt my video. It's my dog. He's always looking out the window to see when dogs are coming. That's like his thing. It's like his sport. Anyway, yeah, rate the video, subscribe to my channel. Turn on your post notifications so you don't miss anything I post. Any likes of videos. Also, I want to take the time to thank you guys so much for 500 subscribers. I started in October, but I didn't really start posting until December. So to have already reached that point is just amazing. And I really appreciate you guys' support. As I always do, even on my other channel, I really appreciate your support. And I have a surprise coming when I reach a thousand followers or subscribers. Subscribers for YouTube, followers for Instagram. I always get them mixed up. But I have a surprise coming. So look forward to that. Tell your friends about me and my page and my content. Talk to you guys soon. Thank you for watching.